you know, I don't know if the algorithm is doing what it's doing just because they know it's going to get a rise out of me, but it worked. I've been getting a lot of content coming my way. It's grinding my gears. A lot of Mario Kart comment, content. A lot of a lot of people out there boasting and bragging about their Mario Kart skills. And what they don't realize is I am the greatest driver to ever do it. And you know, there's a story I want to share with you. Actually, maybe you're familiar. Have you uh, have you ever seen those nature documentaries on the cable? You see the one about lions? Lion sitting there under a tree in the middle of Africa. He's so big, so hot. He doesn't want to move. Little lion cubs see this. They start nipping at his toes, biting his ears. And he doesn't do anything. The lioness starts messing with him. <laughs> if anyone picks up what I'm putting down, you say the name of the movie, I'll send you a book. The lioness starts messing with him. He doesn't move. And the other animals in the kingdom see this. The jackals. Hyenas. <laughs> I haven't seen this movie in a while. I'm kind of losing it. Oh, I haven't played in a while either. And they start to move in. Getting closer. Eating the food. In his domain. Until one day, the lion decides to get up. It runs like the wind, tears the shit out of everybody, eats everything in his path. Because every now and again, the lion has to show the jackals who he is. I used to be able to do a Christopher Walken impression. I haven't done it in a while. I didn't want to commit to it. If you didn't pick up on it, not Tito Ortiz. If you didn't pick up on it, that's a hint. It's a Christopher Walken movie. First person to drop a comment as to what movie that was, I'll send you a book. And I didn't do it justice. Next time I do that, I'm going to I'm going to memorize that monologue and next time I do it, I'm going to I'm going to commit to it. You're talking to me all wrong. It's the wrong tone. You do it again. I'll stab you in the face with a soldering iron. But yeah, so I, you know, I saw this video. It's these these parents, and they're like, "Oh, when the kids asked to play Mario Kart, but they didn't realize that you grew up in the '90s. They don't realize you're a Rainbow Road expert." And the way I see it, if I ever have a kid that even dares of challenging me to Mario Kart as if they have a chance, I did something wrong. Everyone in my domain, all the jackals, all the hyenas need to know, this is my kingdom. <laughs> What's up, guys? How's everyone doing? T-Bone. T-Bone Experience, I don't know if you found my channel because you, because of my recent video title, or if you're my friend uh, who went by the nickname T-Bone, but either way, what's up? Ryan, what's up? You know, I was trying to get Crazy Taxi, um, I should, I'm not as good as that. Alright, you know what, the next one? Next one, I'm doing crazy taxi. All right, I, I wanna, I'm, I'm gonna catch up on these comments, and I'll get an eighth place, and then I'll come back and win this one, even though it's a short one. Uh, I did, I did uh, have a little stint as a teacher, 
Sure, I'll pick you up, Toast and Donut. Where you at? Yeah, try and occasionally in videos I'll mention, uh, you know, uh, what's up, JDX the kid? Love you too. Thanks for the kind words. Yeah, occasionally I'll mention that I'm a teacher. Um, uh, but that was many years ago. Oh, you love my streams? Thanks. I don't know if Prison's Honor is the name of a movie, but that's not it. Um, man, thanks for saying you love my streams. That encourages me to do it. That's right. Joseph, as Joseph says, bro's always driving a worker at home. You know, honestly, oh, I just got laughed. All right, watch me come back. I'm about to, I'm about to show y'all what I'm made of. Oh, that's not good. Yikes. All is not lost. This will be a miracle, though. Uh... Actually, I got a little ahead of myself. I blew it. <laughs> well, as they say, my friends, pride cometh before the fall. Ah, that's not good. I needed a lightning there. I did miss a box. If I didn't miss that box, I might have had it. All right, you know what I'm going to do just to prove it? I'm going to start this next one. And I'm going to wait until I get lapped to start. How about that? You know, I come in here hot, talking a big game, and then I make a fool out of myself. That's fine. All right. I got this. It's fine. It's fine. Well, thanks for showing up, guys. Um, yeah, so anyway, as I was, uh, you know, in reality, for those of you, I think I mentioned it on a stream. Uh, I know I mentioned it in some video because somebody made a comment uh, about Lent, and uh, I'm pretty sure it was on a screen, but uh, I, I've always liked Lent. I've been a big fan of Lent. And something I like about Lent is not the idea of giving something up, but adding something. And this year for Lent, I told myself I'm going to show up to YouTube every single day, whether it's in the form of whatever it is. And, you know, I talked about this last time. I'll probably talk about it again more. I'm going to wait till I get lapped and I'm going to come back and win. Um, mark my words. Um, and I'll bet, I'll bet first place. I'll give away a book. If anyone, uh, you want a book, Ryan? If I don't, you're the, just the first comment I saw that uh, that said they wanted a book. So if someone else beat you to it, but Ryan, if you wanted a book, if you want a book, and I don't get first after this race, I'm sending a book your way. Um, so anyway, I just promised myself I'm gonna show up to YouTube every single day, and uh, you know the thing about YouTube, as we talked about before, as I mentioned on the last stream, I'm gonna wait till everyone laughs me. Um, the thing is, YouTube, oh man, Ryan, you might be getting the book, dude, what are the odds of that, oh, oh, oh man, oh man, this is not a strong start, I still have faith though, <laughs> oh man, uh, you know, YouTube, I've been doing this a long time and I love YouTube and it's like a puzzle. And as many creators have left the platform, oh, have said it's different than what it was before. You know, it's like, it's like a job and the, uh, the creator in me that loves to create, you know, especially with this channel, the way I'm doing it, it's, it's almost like I am happy with creating content that I know won't do as well because it's content that I want to create. You know, this stuff I believe in and that's why I made the book to feed into that. Um, all that said, you know, there's like this, I don't know if the competitor in me or just like, you know, just the person who loves YouTube. Um, you know, there's like this constant push and pull between, uh, oh, I guess Peach is in first, yeah. Between like, okay, do I make the content I want to make and that I enjoy and that I know my audience 
that you know would enjoy because they subscribed to me in the first place for this kind of content or do i make the content that's going to work on youtube oh man oh well at least i didn't get last but ryan you are getting yourself a book damn it well listen i'm doing i'm gonna do this this is my game today if i didn't get blown up twice when i got lapped we got it all right ryan got himself a book that's that's one book i'm gonna write that down ryan make sure you uh email me Email me at the driver ed show at Gmail and let me know your address. Uh, what can, I, can I write on this? Yeah. Um, let's see, I'll put it on this. All right. Well, I'm doing this again. So, next person who wants a book, if a couple people throw it out there, um, if I don't get first, somebody else is getting a book. Um, so, let me know if you want one and you'll be enter, entered into the raffle. Anyway, as I was saying, the tricky thing is, it's like if I make a video that I know my audience will like. Oh, wait. I'll, I'll wait. Um, but it doesn't play for the YouTube algorithm. Then it doesn't reach my audience. So it's this constant like game you have to play where it's like be the creator you like and you enjoy or like play the game of YouTube. Perfect example. And this like can make it really similar. I don't know if you guys notice this. But like on your home screen, I'd be willing to bet – any amount of money that the majority of the videos recommended to you are over eight minutes long. So, like, YouTube just likes videos that are eight minutes long because you can get uh, the mid-roll ads, you know? Videos under eight minutes long, under eight minutes long aren't going to have the ads in the middle of them, right? So, like, a couple of my videos in the past week or whatever, long-form videos, horizontal ones, they're, like, I think the one was a minute and ten seconds long. Oh my god, dude, there has to be some sort of code in there that like 8th place always hits somebody they lap. Um, but, and, and like, it's crazy, like my, all the other metrics on those videos are great. Uh, whether it's, oh, that was a mistake. Watch time, retention, uh, well, not watch time, but retention, click-through rate, like likes, engagement, comments. But because it's not giving a lot of watch time, YouTube doesn't put that out currently for their, oh, come on, Luigi. So basically what I'm saying is this isn't me complaining and I don't know, you know, if you're not, in, like this, this is the kind of stuff, uh, you know, I like talking about is I like watching videos like vidIQ and Nate Black and stuff like, like I love this stuff. I find it so interesting as the YouTuber, but as the creator, I'm like, I don't, I don't want to make a Mr. Beast video, you know, I, and, and I don't say that, I know you run the risk of sound like, you know, yeah, right, like, don't get me wrong, I would love Mr. Beast's success, 100%, I'm not saying that, I'm just saying, the creator in me just that just isn't you know what drives me to create if that makes sense um oh man i'm gonna be giving out books left and right all right this is crazy you know what it is the course is too short we're gonna try this one more time man killing me driver ed show at gmail.com um so anyway i just promised myself show up to youtube every day no matter what Today got a little away from me. Usually I like to post around sometime in the afternoon. Today got a little away from me. And so I'm like, I got to show up to YouTube. So here I am on the live. But honestly, I appreciate the kind words. And the fact that you guys love my uh, love my streams makes me a little more uh, encouraged to do this. All right, let me catch up on these comments. Where in Philly you at toast and donut? Oh, so T bone is not the T bone either or that I mentioned. You're a you're OG. That was the first. I was actually just looking at it. That was the first. So uh, he said you used to watch with the water ice and pretzels video. That was the first like Uber confessions video I did. So you are an OG. Um. Hey, I, I, JDX loves the loves the love the dad jokes. I'm right there with you. Um, who is Jim Carrey? 
you, you got oh you, that 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 but I mean if you if you're if you're dropping jet dad jokes you you know who Jim Carrey is. Um, so JDX said he picked up on the worms quote from that video, Dumb and Dumber. Who was Jim Carrey? Right, you're playing Jeopardy. Got it. And thankfully, I was a so JDX said thankfully I was the last generation that had cool teachers that so classics in classics in class on free days. Dumb and Dumber was one of them. Man, I really hope that's a good point. Like with technology these days, I know so many schools, like even like schools in underserved communities, like every single kid has an iPad or a Chromebook or something. And to your point, I it makes me wonder, like, it, do do teachers not sh- do substitute teachers not show movies anymore? Do they like you know play on their iPads or something? Because that would suck. Movie days were the best, man. I remember watching Braveheart in, in class. That was that was great, and that wasn't even like a a lazy day. It was related to uh, I think because we were reading Macbeth. Um, Lent is. Uh, it's really, I mean, I think Catholics go hard with it, but uh, it's technically just Christian Christian in general. Um, <laughs> so Garp said, when I was little, I asked my dad, not a practicing Catholic, what he was giving up for Lent. He said he was giving up using the word agenda. <laughs> now that I'm adult, I think that's hilarious. That is hilarious. <laughs> I might steal that. Um, oh, man, where's the book? You guys don't know about the book? So if you guys like my channel, you will love internationally known, locally disrespected. These are all oh, blue coming in. That's why blue is... Blue. That's why Blue's moderator. Blue coming in clutch. That's the link there. Um, working on the audio book. And uh, if you guys enjoy my channel, you'll enjoy the stories in there for sure. Um, just the craziest, uh, most exciting, most interesting, most impactful, you know, to me at least, uh, stories um, that I've had while Ubering. And by impactful, I don't mean like what happened to me. I just mean like stories that like you know, whether it was funny or like a lesson or just like, honestly, these stories like change the way I look at people and look at life. So, um, that's why I want to get out there and share. And, uh, you know, Ryan Griffin will have a copy in the mail and somebody else, uh, you know, I didn't, I didn't get, uh, I didn't get first. So I, I owe someone else a book. If you're interested, um, I don't want to miss it. Big, bald, and beautiful. What is up? I love the name. The Patriot, another classic. Yo, JDX is saying they love language arts and history. And I, uh, I too... Love that. Yeah, I mean, Toast and Donut, you were the first person to ask about it. If you're interested in it, you're in. Just send that email to driveredshow at uh, gmail.com. So, um, you know, I, I know where you're from. So just tell me, you know, to, to make sure you, you know, let me know your address in there. That way I know it's you because I guess everyone, anyone could email me. But, uh, you know, I like to think people who follow along with this channel are, uh, honest people so don't don't steal toast and donuts book um you can send that email and then uh voltic riders guess what you're the next person to say it so ricardo what's up voltic riders this this next one is if i don't get first here you get yourself a book and then if i don't get first here we're going to move on to the next one because it might just be too impossible because it's too short. Now, what I'm going to do, all I said was I just need to get laughed and be an eighth. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go backwards because it's going to give me a little more time to come back. I'm going to go backwards until I get into eighth. 
or sorry, get lapped by. I gotta pass everybody. You guys follow follow what I'm saying? We got a book on the line here. If I don't get first, you're getting a book. Voltic Riders, Raiders, or all right, that's everybody. Let's rock. Oh, also, nobody got the movie yet. This lion. So big. So hot. He doesn't want to move. Come on. Oh! Oh, come on. Oh, I blew it. I think you're getting a book. Oh, yeah. Damn it. Well, hopefully I can at least get fourth so I don't have to play this level again. <sighs> I need lightnings. There we go. And I will say, I haven't played this in a while. I know I'm making excuses, but... When I was a, back in my day, when I was dedicated to the game, they'd never seen anyone do it like me. Here we go. All right. Still a chance. Uh, maybe not. Man, I suck again. I'm embarrassed. Honestly, I've never thought of deleting a stream before. I might delete this stream. I'm, I can't even look at the camera right now. I'm, I'm thoroughly, thoroughly embarrassed. Yikes. Maybe I don't got it. Maybe that's maybe that's exactly what the algorithm was doing. Maybe the algorithm knows me so well where they're like, this guy sucks at Mario Kart and I need to let him know. Man, I'm pissed. Damn it. Uh -oh. All right, Voltaire Riders, Raiders, I'm sorry. I'm blanking on your name because I'm too mad at myself right now, but... Shoot me that email. The driver ed show at Gmail. Oh boy. Oh man. <laughs> it's it's a stupid thing to get so upset about, but I'm actually like <laughs> I guess it's just like what did I, what did I do to my my very valuable skill set, you know, cuz this is extremely valuable. I I could make I could I could turn this into a million dollar career. Oh, shoot. I actually I I won't harp on this too often and I only say this cuz I highly doubt he watches this video, so it's not like I'm rubbing in his face. It's not like something I don't uh, mention every now and again. Actually, more that he mentions, complains about. But I uh, let's just say I had a pretty successful Mario Kart career in college, and it uh, a little friendly wagering turned into a uh, very profitable endeavor. Let's put it that way. That's all you need to know about that. Oh man! All right, pool hall junkies. Yes, let's go. All right, big bald and beautiful. If if you want a book, I said the first person who gets gets it is uh. If you want a book, email me the Drive Red Show. All right, I just gave out four. I just gave out four books. I don't know if I can give out any more. I'm gonna run out of books. 
Uh, next level is the beach. All right. This is my last wager for a book. So the next person who wants one gets one. And then that's five books and that's it. I can't give out more than five books a stream. Maybe that'll be the new uh, new limit. But I'm going to wait until... Oh, man. Come on. Who wants... Actually, that's helpful because it gets me back there faster. Come on. Oh, here we go. Did I pass them all? No, not yet, not yet, not yet. All right, let's rock. I need to get this. Oh, Warren, get out of my way. Oh, no. All right, that was big, but it's okay. I'm feeling good about this. I'm locked in. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Oh, I was holding my breath there. All right. Do I do the sure thing shortcut or the ramp? I'm a gambler, baby. I'm doing the ramp. I need to get this. Otherwise, I'm screwed. Oh, nice. Oh, almost too much. Come on. I don't know if I'm going to make it, guys. This is it. Oh, boy. Oh, I jumped too early. That's just lack of practice. Somebody else is getting a book. Man, I suck at this game. Oh, God. Oh. If I got that ramp, I might have had a chance. Ah, oh, this is pathetic. If you guys want to unsubscribe, I don't blame you. Oh my. I'm, alright, I'm not going to delete this stream. I'm just going to keep it up as motivation. So I practice. But I may change the title, because... I, I I don't know if I'm the best to ever do it. This is just embarrassing, guys. Like, don't look at me. <laughs> don't don't look at me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Damn, man, I suck. Voltic riders, I am going to do that. And I'm, I'm it's gonna make a video. That's really cool. Yeah, so I guess big, bald, and beautiful is he's saying the quote. Now the little lions come and start messing with him, biting his ears, nipping at his toes. I, I tried to do that at the start of of the uh, of the stream. Check this out. Next stream, I'm gonna have that memorized, and I'm going to no no book. I'm not wagering a book on this one, but the next one I am. Going to have that memorized, and that's how I'm going to start it. Oh, my God. I actually suck at Mario Kart. I never thought this day would come. And I'm going to be better at Mario Kart, and we're going to give away some more books, or hopefully give away zero books, because I will be awesome at Mario Kart. Oh, my gosh. This is just like... I'm I'm thoroughly embarrassed. Thoroughly. It 
Who am I? I don't even recognize myself right now. Oh my gosh. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Whoop, there it is. Oh, I should put the uh, Mario Kart sound on. Where's the sound? Why isn't this working? That's weird. Oh, you know what? I needed to update the uh, the player. Maybe that's why. Don't you guys think about beating me. Should I take the safe route? No chance. No guts, no glory. Come on, Ed. I gotta be better. I gotta. I felt like I got. I just wasn't confident, you know? Like, what kind of drive. What kind of Mario Carter am I if I'm not gonna be confident in my ramps? Come on, Ed. Oh, man. Big, bald, and be beautiful. I just love saying that name. Ask, has anyone ever told me that you sound like Adam Sandler? I don't hear it now. Or when you're filming at your desk, but sometimes when you're recording in your car, I swear Adam Sandler's talking. I have gotten that all my life. Excuse me. And I don't think as much now, but when I was younger, I think I looked like him more too. And it's just, it's weird because it's one of those things. I think maybe we're living in a simulation and, you know... The, the AI in charge just ran out of ideas or something because I am a huge Adam Sandler fan. And, you know, I mean, I, I don't think it's like I was a huge enough fan to, like, you know, watch so many movies. I, like, emulated him. It's just, it's just a weird... I have, you know, you obviously don't get, you know, you don't turn into looking like someone you're a fan of. Um, oh boy. So anyway, yeah, it's just always been a, a weird coincidence that I think I look like him and people say I sound like him sometimes and, uh, I can do a pretty damn good impression of him too. I actually started this little side, like this stupid little side channel, um, of just like comedy, like Adam Sandler impressions. Uh, I think. It's called O'Doyle Rules 3000 because O'Doyle Rules was taken. But. Tally hoo hoo. Shabby doo hoo. Yoshi is better. He comes in first and cleans the hair. That doesn't make it doesn't have any hair. Peach is better. <laughs> gotta gotta flesh that joke out a little bit. Didn't didn't really make much sense. Oh, I thought I was done. See, this this is what I'm capable of, guys. See this? This is who I am. Half a lap ahead of these clowns. Just embarrassed. Just absolutely embarrassed. Oh, I'm getting a little tired. Mm. Oh, shoot. All right, my friends. I'm I'm like legit disappointed with myself. I'm a much better player than this. I don't know what happened. This is 
you know, your kind words have not only encouraged me to stream more, but my lack of performance makes me think I need to get back out here. So I'm going to be back doing this again. Um, everyone, everyone who won a book, congratulations. And, uh, yeah, big, bald, and beautiful did not know I was giving out a book for the answer. So, uh, you know, shoot me an email at the driver ed show at Gmail and, uh, let me know. And, and please be honest, you know, uh, if there's a way I can tell that it's actually you, if it's not actually you and you're stealing a book from me, that wouldn't be cool, but I'm trusting you guys cause I like you. And, uh. I, the way I see it is, if you're the one stealing a book, you know, that's on you. Um, that would be a shame if that's true. So anyway, please, only the people that won, shoot me the email. But as promised, I bet a book on each of those races and I lost it. And we'll be back to do this again some other time. So what's up, guys? Um, I'm just getting out of here. Konnichiwa. Phone wallet. Have you heard the classic track Phone Wallet Keys by Adam Sandler? I feel like I have. But. Zach White, just do better. Okay, Zach. Z. You gotta play. Bridge Racer or Pit Stop. Honestly, I don't even know those. Uh, I don't even know those uh, those games. Can you hand deliver it and take me for a joyride in your fast car? Um, that, I'm not sure. I'm not sure where in Philly you're at. And, you know, if you do need a ride and you're going somewhere and I can make it work, I'm happy to. But uh, the, the the thing about, you know, the, the Uber pickup that everyone always, like the scheduled Uber pickup that everyone always uh, forgets is like it's always, you know, when you're Ubering, and you're in it, and you're already there. So if I'm already, if I get an Uber to, you know, New Jersey, and then my next ride's in New Jersey, it's like, oh, I'm 10 minutes down the road. But if somebody wants me to pick them up in Northeast Philly, and I'm in Delco, that's an hour to get there, and then an hour back, you know? So it's it's always tough to coordinate it, you know what I'm saying? So that that's why I'm always hesitant to, like, commit to a ride, you know? Um, but I'm sure it would be fun. And maybe it's something, you know, keep in mind in the future. If, uh, you know, doing a video, you want to be a part of the video, I, I think that'd be cool. Am I ever going to play Super Mario on here? Oh, but man, Blue is the moderator of the year. That's the channel I was talking about. Yeah, so if you like Adam's stupid, I'm, I'm talking, this is very stupid. Very stupid comedy content. You know, it, it's like, just be so stupid it makes you laugh. Kind of that, Like, that's the MO with it. Um, then yeah, check that out. It's basically a page of Adam Sandler impressions. Um, when Adam Sandler's making the biopic about his life and they need somebody to play him, they'll find my channel and be like, whoa, this is a bald Adam Sandler. We just got to give him a wig and we got our man. Um... Triple B, that's noted. Um, yeah, right. Okay, exactly what I'm talking about. Will you pick me up in Michigan? I need to ride in Florida. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> I got to drive to Michigan, and then uh, and then I end up in Florida. And I got to get home. <laughs> JDX says, I'm actually the bat hiding behind the person of an Uber driver. You know, I always thought how like an uber driver would be like the perfect like undercover you know like like an fbi like some like you just you just never i've thought of that before i'm like you know if i wasn't me i would suspect me of being something that i'm not <laughs> but that's <laughs> stupid thinking because <laughs> oh yeah um but yeah, this was a lot of fun, guys. Congrats on the people with the books. And uh, I will see you again soon. Like I said, I'm posting every day until uh, 
I think I think it's like March March 20th I think is 40 days so every day it's going to be a short a video a, a live I'm showing up to YouTube every day so uh either look for a video in the afternoon and if that doesn't come through it's probably going to be a live at night um but this was a lot of fun guys thanks for coming out and um Oh, that's hilarious. I legit saw a Wi-Fi hotspot labeled FBI van before outside of an ABC store. And there was legitimately a van outside. <laughs> Dude, that's, that's the government. <laughs> um, that's really funny, actually. That's hilarious. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, it's a lot of fun, guys. Thanks for coming out. Have a great night, and I will uh, catch you on the flip.